pulling the trigger on the Bissell. Hello everyone, this is Just a Dad. Today I'm gonna to do a comparison between these two carpet cleaners. On the left, I got the Bissell Pro Heat 2X. It is corded. And on the right, I got the Hoover One Power Cordless Carpet Cleaner. It's called the Smart Wash. So the Bissell's got a cord you gotta plug in. With the Hoover, I just gotta make sure the One Power battery is charged, then plug it in. Now the Bissell has a trigger here. It's only gonna release solution when I press the trigger. The Hoover has an automatic mode. When it goes forward, it releases solution. When you pull back, it's suction only. And we have a spot mode. So here it is in auto, it's saying dry. When you go forward, it's gonna say wash, then dry. Then I've got a spot where it puts solution down the entire time. And then I can come back to dry only. No trigger, it does it automatically when it's in auto. Now the Bissell has a neat thing, this spray. If I press this button, it's gonna spray some solution out that front nozzle. Okay, so let's turn them on and see how they do on these really tough stains. I've got the Hoover in auto. Now I'm pulling the trigger on the Bissell. Now the Bissell is a little bit heavier, but it rolls pretty easy. I'll go to spot on the Hoover. So it's putting solution down the entire time. Okay, let's go to dry only. Both of them are in dry only. The Hoover is much lighter to push on the carpet. Okay, so the Bissell, it did a little bit better. The Hoover, I, maybe I should have put it in spot when I was doing these stains, but I wanted to show you auto. So it was only putting solution down going forward, going back was drying. Over here on the Bissell, I was pulling the trigger for a while, going back and forth, and then I did dry only. They're both about the same dampness. So here's where the clean water goes. You're gonna fill this up with water and solution. And then the dirty water is down here. You're gonna take this over the sink, open this up. You can empty all of that out. On the Bissell, you're gonna take this, take this over the sink, empty this out, open this up. You can empty it all out. Now, both of these come apart for easy cleaning. I can take this all the way off. There's just two tabs underneath there, but I can clean that. This one, push, push here. Yeah, push those two tabs and pull up on this. It's got two brushes. I can take this over the sink, get this all nice and clean and clean these also. So if you got an entire house to clean, you know, the Hoover is definitely lighter weight. The Bissell probably does a little bit better job on some tough stains. Okay, so they, not, they might've done the same. I love treating them with this Folex. You know, if I had treated those stains with this, I think they would have cleaned about the same, but it kind of did show you know, the Bissell Pro Heat 2X does a good job. Now in their advertising, it claims it out cleans the leading courting uh, competition, which they say is the Bissell Pro Heat 2X Revolution 3588. That's what I've got there. You know, I don't think it out cleaned it. It's gonna outlast it because it's lightweight and portable. You know, the Revolution or the Bissell, you do have to plug in, it is heavier. And the Bissell, you can also turn into like a, a spot cleaner. It's got a hose and some attachments you can connect right there. And you can like clean the couch or something with it. The Hoover doesn't have that option. Okay, now let's get into price. The Bissell, $270. That's a good price. Hoover, $478. That's a lot of money. Um, you've got to really want portability for that. Um, that's got to come down in price. You know, I'm $400 maybe. Um, I mean, it is super lightweight, no cord. You know, it does a good job with the front and the going forward and back in auto mode. It, it does a good job. I just think that's a pretty high price for it. I do like that I have it. I did buy both of these with my own money. You know, would I go out and spend $480 on the Hoover? Maybe if I was into that ecosystem, which I kind of am. I love their one power uh, cordless vacuum cleaner. I absolutely love, that's the one I use every day. So I do like having those extra one power batteries and a charger. 
you know, this has a place. It is lightweight. It does a good job cleaning carpets. You know, that Bissell can be kind of a, it can be kind of hard to maneuver around going up and down stairs with it. It is kind of heavy. And you can see the clean shot. I mean, it works okay, but it kind of squirts the solution. It needs to come out a little bit slower. So be sure and check out my next video. I'm going to be comparing the Hoover to the Pet, the uh, Power Dash, which is $99. It's a corded uh, carpet cleaner. And I'll be also comparing it to the Power Scrub. Underneath the video, if you could give it a thumbs up, that really helps out my YouTube channel. Be sure and check me out on Instagram, just to dad videos, also on my Facebook group page. I do end up giving these products away after I'm done. Just a dad videos Facebook group page and on Instagram, just a dad videos. Again, I bought both of, both of these with my own money. I'll put links underneath in the show description notes because I really do love, no, I mean, don't get me wrong, I love the Hoover. It has a place. Um, if you absolutely need portability, lightweight, you know, and no cord, it's going to work. It's going to work really, really good. So I hope this video helps. Thanks everybody for watching.